am on day 1566. Hey girl, hey girl, hey, my beautiful, gorgeous best friend. Y'all, today is Friday, October 25th, and I am looking forward to the most amazing day. Yes, it's the next day, but we're going to go ahead and check in for Friday. So you can already see, I got started just like how I typically do. So since I did not have to go to work on this morning, y'all, no alarm was set, but I did go ahead and wake up at like 4.30, and I started out my usual doing my devotion, my prayer, and giving thanks. That's a non-negotiable for me. And just in case you do want to follow along, okay? My um my morning devotions can be found on the Bible app. So once I got done with that, it was time to head on downstairs to get my workout in. So I started out like I typically do. I start out with a lot of stretching. Then you girl, okay, you see, I'm still on my long um, walk. So I got a very long walk in um this morning. And when I tell you, I felt so good. Yes, felt so good after getting done. And then, of course, I got into my resistance training, y'all. I did like my um Pilates moves, my body weight exercise and the things. And then I got into my cool down and stretch. So also, sleep school was an 83. So after that, it was time to head on upstairs and just kind of get myself ready for the day. Now, since I was off work on today, y'all, I wanted to just kind of relax, just chill out and enjoy because here's the thing, you already know what's about to happen next week. You already know we're going through this transition and you know, a lot of unknowns. So I figured, you know what, I should just use this day, you know, just kind of getting things together, you know, like around the house, of course, starting to get things, you know, um, in place because I don't know if I've mentioned this or not, but next week I'll actually be away from my home, away from my family for a few days. So, you know, I just really wanted to spend the morning and the day just pretty much just like not only resetting the house, but just kind of taking care of things that needed to be done. So what is the weather like right now? You know, here, y'all, the temperatures here in the great state of Alabama, girl, <coughs> I don't know what's really going on, okay? The temperatures are tripping. When I tell you early morning, it's like 40 degrees, but then by the end of the day, girl, the highs are like in the 80s. I know it is so hard to determine, you know, like how even to dress. It's like the craziest thing. So no, but once I got done taking care of things at the house, my husband and I did need to run out, you know, just to take care of a couple of errands. And then we made it back to the house and just got to sit, just kind of pretty much just chilled out and just relaxed and just, 
did all the things. Now you have already seen, you know, what I broke my fast with, you know, and once again, girl, you already know, I don't know how this vlog is going to be edited or anything like that. So I just appreciate all the kind. Let me say this too, because see, I was having a moment. Okay. I was going through reading all of you guys comments. When I tell you, nobody can tell me I do not have like the best friends in the whole entire world. Y'all literally, I start to turn the camera back on, but I'm like, no, nah, cause they're going to be like, sis, you over there being dramatic. When I tell you every single comment, y'all do not know. I just, it, it means a lot to me. Okay. When you are just kind of following me along on this journey, as I share really my life, I oftentimes say, you know, that girl being here on the internet, sometimes it's not easy. Okay. And I'm putting my life, you know, out there. And I know, you know, oftentimes on the internet, you don't know what's real and what's not real. And you don't know if people, if that's that true person. Okay. But you know, I hope you have seen something in me to know that no girl, this is, this is real Dr. Erica right here. And I put my life out there and just in an attempt to not only just share my journey, but also, you know, hopefully just encourage someone out there to just really make that decision to show up for yourself, make yourself a priority, be the main character in your life. So whatever journey that may be on, whether it's like health and wellness, you're trying to glow up in, you know, if it's a financial glow up girl, whatever the case may be. So, um, yeah, I sat there, I read through some comments, y'all, you know, and I also say too, you know, if I don't respond to a comment or if I have to just leave some hearts, once again, y'all, I read all of and I just, just wanted to come on here and say, like, I just truly do appreciate it. Now, another thing that I want um, to go ahead and, girl, hop back on. Remember on yesterday, we talked about our November challenge. So really quick, you know, go ahead, check in with all the things that we, you know, check in every single day from your water your steps, okay, or your workout, okay, um, your fast or your nutritional component of your day. You want to know about your sleep. You want to know about your mental health. How are you doing today? You know, have you prayed? Have you done your deep breathing? Have you done your journaling? Things like that. So we want to know everything there is to know about your day because once again, this is all for accountability. But as far as the October challenge, be sure that you're checking in. We're nearing the end of our October challenge where you were supposed to, if you're participating, you're supposed to be getting in 25 sets of any body weight exercises, exercise that you choose. And then also, you know, limiting or eliminating your processed in, um, foods and sugar. So be sure to check in with that. And then also on yesterday's vlog, I mentioned the November challenge. Now I think I'm going to give it one more day. Okay. As far as like what the thing will be. Remember, it will be either no limits, November, no excuses, November, or now is the time, November. So those are your three choices. We'll give it one more day. And when I come back on tomorrow, I'll definitely let you know what will be the thing. But what we're going to focus on for this month will be getting in a walk. Okay. Now hear me out. Hear me out. Remember, just like with every single challenge, you know, you have to customize it and make it your own. Okay. So getting in, I'm going to say at least a 10 minute walk on top of what you already do. Okay. Because we already know there are so many benefits to walking y'all, not only in the physical sense, but also in the mental sense. So be sure that you're getting in at least 10 minutes now. Now, listen, if you want to do a little extra, girl, that's fine too, because you know your best friend, I tend to be a little extra, extraordinary that is. And then if you're already a walker, you know, once again, just kind of add some time, you know, to that. So anyway, y'all, I have a jam-packed day. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Of course, I pray you've had the most amazing day. Once again, be sure to check in, okay? Check in. This is all for accountability. Check in with all the things that we check in about, of course, some Somewhere here in the video, I can post, you know, um, my steps and all the things, y'all. I was almost at 20K, but y'all already know how we do. Just keep on, you know, riding with your sis and bear with me until we can kind of get back to our regular scheduled program. Okay, girl, I will see you tomorrow. Bye.